Hey guys, Tiger7 here. I'm going to show you how to change your hard drive and speed up your laptop performance and boot time. I will be working on a 2010 MacBook with a SATA hard drive from Hitachi. For this part, I'm going to swipe my old hard drive with this SanDisk SSD+. Plus. To gain on time, I'm going to cut the video here and remove all the screws. Okay, I'm going to show you how to change your hard drive for a SSD. This is the hard drive that I'm going to change but before I begin changing the hard drive you need to unplug the battery cable to avoid any kind of issue. This is the battery cable. You remove it and then you can access the hard drive and take it out, change it with the new SSD. You need to remove this piece and you will have access to the hard drive. You lift up the hard drive here, you can disconnect it. The next part is to install the new SSD. Before you, you can install the SSD, you need to remove those screws and put them on the new SSD. There is a total of four screws, two on this side and two on the other side. Okay, carefully remove the four screws. I'm going to put back the four screws that hold the SSD. Okay, once you are done putting all the four screws back just plug the SSD in put it back in place do not forget to add this piece once you're done uh, plug back the battery cable This time I'm going to restart and start a timer and see how long it takes. The first lap was uh, the time the computer took to shut down and the second lap is actually the, the time the computer will take to boot up. My SanDisk SSD that I just installed on this MacBook was already updated with the latest version of mac os so it was easy and it was just swipe your old ssd with the new ssd if you want to know how i installed the mac os on the new ssd you can go to my channel i've made a video on how to upgrade your mac ssd and it explains the step the step by step that you have to take in order to install the mac os software in a brand new uh, ssd and after you have installed the macbook software in the in the ssd you just need to follow the steps on this video and you have your macbook upgraded these are all the tools that i use uh, for this small project i use this one to remove all the screws uh, on the back of the the macbook and I use this one to remove 
all four screws that hold the hard drive in place and I use this one to remove the battery cable 